let's give this a try here. We have 0 0.625. We want to divide that by 5. So one way to think about this, you could just write this as 0 0.625, and we could just put it over 5 like this. This would also be okay. But I think what I really want to do is just take the 5 and do it longhand, divide 0 0.625 by 5 longhand here. So 5 does not go into 0, so I'm going to put a 0 up here in a decimal point. 5 does go into 6 because 1 times 5, that's 5. So when I subtract, I end up 6 minus 5 is 1. doesn't go into 1, so we'll move over one place, bring this 2 down. 2 times 5, that's 10. Subtract, we get 2. 5 doesn't go into 2, let's move over 1. Bring that 5 down, and now 5 times 5, that's 25. So 5 times 5 is 25, subtract, no remainder. So 0 0.625 divided by 5 is 0 0.125. If you want to change this to a fraction, there's a link in the video on how to do that. 0 0.125, that is 1 eighth as a fraction. So that's why this is a kind of common number. And because we have 5, 5 times 1 eighth, that's 5 eighths. 0 0.625, that's actually the fraction 5 eighths, which is also very common in mathematics. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.